So we're doing a reef walk today and um, along this reef there's not too much fleshy macroalgae but what we see a lot of is the calcified coralline red algae that encrusts the rocks. And so this is actually a fundamental part of the reef. Once the corals start to die, the coralline red algae crust around it and because it's calcified, it holds it all together. So essentially, if we call the coral the bricks, the calcified red algae would be the mortar. They can hold on and withstand really low light conditions so they can grow to great depths where the light drops out and here in the Kimberley we have a very silty environment so during our dives the water is very stirred up, the light can't travel very deep but these calcified red algae um, can withstand very low light conditions which makes them very strong. So the coral and algae are really the unsung hero of the reef, keeping the whole structure together so the coral reef can build and build and grow on top of itself and not just crumble down as the coral dies.